they just have some type of deranged obsession with you where they need to know what you're doing who you're with yup creeping this is why it's an obsessive lover it's a person here that's obsessed could have rejected you could have ghosted you or something here someone is driving by and stalking you they don't want you to have this money or they don't want you to get this home like they're gonna message you they could be messaging you on the 15th some of you this cycle's long overdue okay world death. hello sagittarius how are you welcome back if you're new make sure to subscribe and join the soul tribe we have a read for you guys this is what is the tea it's a general read so take what resonates and leave what doesn't behind cross watchers are welcome this message is also timeless personal reads are in the link to link in the description box below i want to thank everyone for all the support and with all that out of the way we're going to get started <clears throat> Thank you so much, angels, ancestors, spirit guides, universe, galactic beings, ancient ancestors, elders, guide us in this read for my Sagittarius. What messages do you have for us? Truly grateful for your divine guidance and celestial light. So, my Sash, what do we have for you guys? What is going on? What's the tea here? Okay. We have Pisces on the side, Hangman and High Priestess on the side. Neptune getting ready to station direct. We also have number 8 on the side, the strength card on the side. Leo energy, the sun. Then we have Neptune almost in retrograde. Neptune getting ready to station direct, right? So the Hangman High Priest is almost in reverse, but also on the side. Pisces energy again. <clears throat> so you have the Ten of Pentacles here. Wow. That's really good, actually. Hangman. Hmm. Wow, Sagittarius, Wheel of Fortune, you definitely have some type of financial prosperity headed into your future, but my throat chakra, why is my throat chakra acting up right as we start your read? Someone here is driving by your place, Two of Cups, someone that could have rejected you or could have ghosted you or something here someone is driving by and stalking you okay they're behind the steering wheel <clears throat> wheel of fortune i get like some type of fro chakra attack in this read like somebody doesn't want me to speak about this but there's someone here driving by your home or something yeah, I heard Mercedes, so they could have like a Mercedes, or it could be a rental or a lease. But I definitely heard Mercedes, or you could have a Mercedes. But regardless, someone here is spying in with the Hangman Two of Cups. Let's keep going. <clears throat> yeah, they're they're attacking the throat because they don't want me to tell you guys this. Queen of Cups, Nine of Swords. It's a Queen of Cups here that, it's a Queen of Cups, hold on, that, yeah, King of Wands and the Seven of Swords, like, this is you minding your business, then all the while, this weird Queen of Cups energy is stalking you, washing you, okay, he or she, like, who, whoever they are, like, they're just washing, and they're stressed out, because of something here why ace of pentacles y'all <clears throat> somebody got a read on you and you see here's the thing the reader told them that you're about to buy a house or that you're about to move into a new spot please excuse my speaking okay doing a lot of work on my teeth and they're shifting so if i'm talking a little funny bear with me now but i do feel them uh moving shifting into spot anyhow they went to a reader okay and this reader told them that you're either about to buy a house or something of that nature or you're about to get a very good financial prospect here with the ace of pentacles some of you could be getting some type of position in the medical field you could work in the medical field <clears throat> and you're about to <clears throat> you see they're they're doing these attacks 
you're about to receive like a massive op opportunity with the Ace of Pentacles, the Ten of Pentacles. It's something, there's some type of massive financial blessing on the horizon. And this Queen of Cups energy could be a Scorpio or a Pisces. Or it could be a Sag like yourself or a Leo. They saw your future through a reader and they're angry or they're pissed. They're stressed out. Like they, they don't want you to have this money or to receive this place. Why? Why don't they want Sagittarius to receive this spirit? <clears throat> <clears throat> Seven of Cups. It's a few people here that don't want you to receive this now. There could even be like something here about people in the town or something. Hmm. Eight of Cups or like certain family members. Yeah, Eight of Cups, Eight of Swords, Seven of Wands. Y'all. <coughs> people just won't let up. Like I don't understand. I don't understand why people just won't let up, why they won't just throw in the towel. Like, they already know they can't defeat you. So why are they still going? Why are they still trying to go hard in the paint like they can't beat you? They can't. Seven of Wands. Like, they can't block what you're about to manifest. It's protected by the Most High. So, someone here feels some type of way now. He's hurt or she's hurt. They feel some type of way. And it could even be a few people in the town or certain family members here. Like, they want to keep you in the the same. Like, they don't want to see you pro uh, progress with the Eight of Cups, Eight of Swords. Like, they just want to hold you in place there. Like, these are, I don't know, it, it, are they energy vampire? Because why else would they want to keep you around? You know, like, they're keeping you around to try to siphon your energy. But clearly, they don't know how to be an energy vampire because why haven't they received the opportunity or the abundance? Because it shows them in some type of desperation. <coughs> Shows these people feeling some type of way. Three of Cups. Five of Pentacles. It's up to three to seven people here. From your past or from your hometown. Yeah. Or like they could have been pl all plotting against you. This could even be like gang stalkers or I don't know. It just could be like a group. Or it could be one or two people or three people. <clears throat> But they want to stop y'all. Stop y'all from achieving some type of success. Like they they literally went and got a read on you guys and to see what like the next big life change is for your future. And the reader told them it's the money. Look, Queen of Pentacles and the Six of Pentacles. Money that's gonna make you super, super happy and fulfilled. Ten of Cups. Okay, temperance. This is a blessing from the angelic realm like literally that's what i was getting like the reader told them yeah this sagittarius is about to be in this queen of pentacles six of pentacles position that's really good money that is really good like i don't know some of you honestly maybe some of you are buying a house that's been coming up in a lot of the reads home like people buying their first home but for those of you those of you that already own a home it could be that you are Upgrading appliances, fixing the roof, doing a whole landscaping project that is going to leave the house, the home, you know, the outside of the home, I should say, looking beautiful, right? It's just something here that is like, wow, like, or it could even be a new car. Somebody could be getting a Cybertruck, I heard, <clears throat> or even a Tesla, a Tesla Model X. But these people, they all feel some type of way because of this. Why, what are you trying to tell us in this real spirit? Like, let's just get to it here. The World Knight of Cups. Then there's like... Hold on. Clarify this World and Knight of Cups, Death, and the Four of Pentacles. <coughs> Page of Pentacles. These people are upset because they wanted to 
manifest a like a lower timeline for you. They wanted you to be like struggling or paycheck to paycheck, or they wanted you to be like on the side of the road somewhere, homeless or something, penniless. Basically, in this defeated energy, and then it's so weird because like this Queen of Cups energy, he or she like like once they saw like if this were to actually occur and i rebuke it but if this were to actually occur where you like ended up penniless or homeless that's when this queen of cups scorpio energy was going to come in and save the day or something like they they wanted to bring your reckoning and then come in and save the day but they're not even good like that so how are they going to save the day i guess they wanted you to be in an energy of desperation for help, so then you would have sided with them. I don't even know. I don't even know. This is weird. These people need to, you know, these people need to move on with their life. Like, it's long. This cycle's long overdue, okay? World, death, Knight of Cups, Four of Pentacles. The cycle's complete, okay? It's long, complete. Yeah, you have. This is why. It's an obsessive lover. It's a person here that's obsessed. This card wants to pop out. Yeah, fake smiles. Is someone here that, like, because they're not with you or they don't know what you're doing 24 hours every day of the week, <clears throat> like, they just have some type of deranged obsession with you where they need to know what you're doing, who you're with. Yup, creeping. I'm telling you. But all this person does is waste time. They don't change, right? Or the change that they go through is very minimal. They just don't want you to start this brand new life without them. That's what this is. But people got to learn. Div divination abuser, yeah. So they were getting reads on you, this person. And this person ain't SHIT, okay? They ain't SHIT because what have they done in regards to the spirituality? This person has not done anything. So, um, phase, what is this? This is a really strange read. Look, romantic love affair. Then that's what I was getting with this Knight of Cubs death energy, but I didn't want to put the read in that direction. But you know what? Because this card came out, I do have to talk about this. So it says, sex fix, secret lover. Sagittarius, somebody here, before you go to the next level, before you receive this abundance this opportunity they want to at least have one night of passion like they're acting on face but they're getting ready to actually make an offer to you and they're looking you up okay researching you studying you getting info okay before you move on to the next level somebody here wants to know if you at least give them a night of passion before you know the world you move to your new cycle because this cycle is coming to its end here for good or it already is over yeah love on the brain dreaming fantasizing daydreaming nostalgic so sagittarius this person okay for a lot of you it's a scorpio now but this individual has been fantasizing about you okay for some of you it could be a leo or a pisces i also heard gemini and capricorn but look this person they know, based on what the reader told them, they know that they're going to have to dust it off when it comes to this, when it comes to this, uh, you know, obsession that they have with you. Like, they know they're going to have to release that for good because of where your future is headed. Like, they got confirmation from the reader, right? Your future is moving in a whole different direction. And it's nothing that this person can do. So at the very least, before you guys, you know, never speak to each other again because for some reason they feel like you're you're still not completely over them or you haven't moved on or something i don't know but they're hoping that you know at the very least when they come in and bring you a message okay an offer they're hoping at the very least that the two of you get that thing going and that you don't c-o-c-k block them or p-u-s-s-y block them okay Whatever they got going on down there, like, they're hoping that you don't block them and that they can get their fix from you because this person is in their ego now. Their ego is hurt. So, 
they're going to message you. They could be messaging you on the 15th, some of you. And do not be deceived because they're only messaging you because they want to have you know what with you. They want to have nookie nookie. Okay, one last time. They're not going to stick around because they already got their confirmation from the reader that you're about to receive the financial opportunity of a lifetime. So they just want to... This, this, is an, this is the energy harvesting. This is definitely the energy harvesting right here. Because they just want to have it with you one night and then they're just going to disappear. Right before you receive your opportunity, your abundance. Yeah, I'm getting something here about like burnt hot dog bread. Like somebody could have burnt their hot dog bread, the hot dog buns. And I'm also getting something here about coleslaw. Um, or somebody likes their hot dog buns, like, extra toasty. <clears throat> Happiness, hater, and rejected. Yeah, they're mad. Look. Look. Sagittarius. Oh, my God. Y'all. They're mad because they don't want you to have this money or they don't want you to get this home. Like, unless you're sharing that with them, they don't want you to get it at all. Like, they don't want to see you win in life with someone else or be happy in life with someone else like this this person is bitter and they have a lot of healing that they got to do but the good news is you're about to receive this opportunity is long overdue okay this is long overdue is what i'm saying here and this energy like they're gonna have to move on because you're going to reject them you're going to reject them here they can you know they can pine after you all you want but at the end of the day, it doesn't show you getting into this weird, you know, relationship dynamic with this person. Like, this is all ego. So, that is your read. That's what I have for you. I hope you enjoyed this. I wish you the best of luck and I wish you love and light. Take care.